I just really wanted to take a moment to capture something that's really been in my heart for the last probably about six months. It's just a way to gather friends, family, churches, and various fellowships together to worship our God, to worship our God whose name is great and greatly to be praised. And I just had this idea burning in my heart for a while. And it's not a new idea. The one element I believe is, is just a little bit that I'm like, oh, I really want to do that. The, the idea of a, a two to four hour to six hour, even a 12 hour worship burn or prayer burn is not a new idea. I've heard of people doing that. Some of the houses of prayer will have these long uh, prayer sessions or long worship sh sessions. And so that's not a new idea. And I actually, I really would love that something like that would start happening on a quarterly or monthly basis somewhere in Silicon Valley or many places in Silicon Valley. I think that would be an amazing way to draw people together in unity where we can celebrate the name of God, worship together, and pray and call upon Him together. Numerous worship bands, college bands, youth bands, all coming together, you know, with one hour segments or two hour segments and just worshiping. There won't be teaching, there won't be a lot of structure outside the worship, but just a gathering place to just be worship burns or a furnace of worship for the Lord our God. And, and I think that's something that we can all gather around. The, the one extra little thing that the Lord put on my heart that I, I just really saw was a set of banners. And, and I, we've already made a couple of these banners. We actually have eight of them um, that we've made here at Revival Valley. And, and the idea was to put the names of God on some prayer stations, on prayer stations banners, so that when people come to worship and they come to pray, they have these prayer focuses and the prayer focuses and the worship focuses are literally the names of God because he describes himself and he reveals himself through his names. So here's one of them. It's a prayer station, Jehovah Jireh, God our provider. And so people could come and gather around this station or this place in the auditorium and gather and say, I need the God who provides to show up in my circumstances. I need him to show up in my school, at the university I'm a part of, or I just need him in my life. I am short on provision. I need the God who provides to show up. And so the people who have that particular need, they need to access, they need to call upon the name of the Lord, but specifically the name upon the Lord would gather in this place. And then we had another one, Jehovah Shalom, which is the God of our peace. And so again, if people you know, have a very contentious workplace or there's just a lot of strife happening at their school, they would say, Lord, I need you to show up, but I need you to show up in particular this way as the God of peace and let me be the carrier of peace and show me my place to have peace. And so we would have eight of these, the, the God who heals. God called himself that in Exodus after he'd taken Moses and the people out the God who heals. Jesus is Emmanuel, God with us. And we can have a station just as a reminder and a prayer focus and a worship focus that Jesus is here with us at all times and other names of God. And so these would just be these prayer banners and these prayer focuses or worship focuses would be scattered across the auditorium or whatever meeting room that we were a part of. Maybe we'd have just four of them or two of them, or maybe we'd have all eight or 10 of the names of God throughout the area. And it would really be, I, I can gather around, I want God to show up in my office. Yes, we should pray for that. And I want him to make a difference in my school, my family, my neighborhood, my workplace. But it's really pressing in even further. Like, God, don't just show up, but show up in this particular way that you revealed that you delight showing up. You, you love showing up as a provider, as a healer, as peace. And so that's, that's the, the little bit of a wrinkle that I think we could gather around and all all stripes of Christianity, all denominations, I believe, can gather around the names of God and praying for more of the names of God. So that's sort of my call, that we could come together and worship and celebrate the name of God or the names of God, how he revealed himself, but also come together and pray and call upon the name of God to show up in our circumstances and in the places scattered throughout Silicon Valley. So that's my invitation, is I want to invite all church worship teams, all college worship bands, youth group musicians, intercessor teams, people who have prayer hearts, and anyone in need to, that we maybe can gather. And maybe we can create places and spaces where we can start gathering to call upon the name of the Lord and to celebrate the name of the Lord together as many churches, as many fellowships, as many ministries unified under the name of our most high God. And that we can love each other and love him together. So that's my heart's desire to start stirring up this vision and as many people as I can and we can just start gathering together in this. So that's it. Praise God.